Guten Tag and hello, I'm Lyle from Jeng Zeta Name and welcome back to Kingdom Come Deliverance. Now we are in the middle of the woman's slot DLC and I have a question for you guys because I looked it up and apparently this DLC is about six hours long. So that would mean probably around five to six episodes of this. I'm not sure if you all are into that or not. I am not sure if I have the mental capacity to do this uh, without exploding. Um, so I'm just asking you, do you want to see the full DLC or do you say, okay, one more episode and then it's good and you can tell us what the hell happened. Just let me know in the comments, what would you prefer to see? So for now, we are just going back in. We were just at Henry's and his mother told us that some girls were looking for us. So that's who we are going to find, I think. Good day, Teresa. Bianca! Where are you? There you are. What do you need? Bianca, how come you're up so bright and early? Papa has me running around from dawn till dusk. You know how it is. Indeed I do. I'm glad you're here, Tess. You've got to help me with something. But first, can you go and see Henry for me? He's at the sheepfold by the stockade, as usual. Oh, playing around with wooden swords again? Aye, he's getting ready for the life of a mighty warrior. Well, at least we know he'll be able to protect you from outlaws with wooden swords. <laughs> oh well, boys and their games. Listen, would you bring him a beer for me? But why don't you bring it yourself? If Pa saw me running after Henry, he'd tend my hide. But I can't leave him dry in this heat. All right, I'll bring the beer to him. Thanks. And don't forget to tell him it's from me. Everyone knows all the beer in Scallops is from you and your Pa. <laughs> you know what I mean. And listen, Tess. Once you've given him the beer, come back to me again. Meanwhile, I'll make an excuse to Pa. I need you to go somewhere with me. But I'll tell you all about it after. Run along before the beer gets warm. Alrighty. I'll be right back with that. I can I can do that. I can bring Henry a beer. The poor man who apparently can't go get a beer himself if he's thirsty. That's very sad for him. On the account that he apparently doesn't have legs and a brain. Hi, Henry. God be with you, Henry. Mind you don't get hurt. Good day, Teresa. How are you doing? I brought you a beer. I brought you a beer. I'd say you'd need it after a hard battle. Ah, great. It's as hot as Pa's forge out here today. That's very sweet of you to get me a beer. It wasn't for me, it's from Bianca. Actually, Bianca sent it. Her Pa doesn't want her to come here. Ah, I see. I'll make it up to her this evening. I don't want to know how. <laughs> how come you're training on your own today? <laughs> you're usually here with that vagabond. God! What's his name? Vanyek. And he's not a vagabond. He's a wayfaring combat master. Well, it sure looks he like is. he's off wayfaring somewhere else today. Yeah. <laughs> More likely sleeping off last night's boozing. Actually, <laughs> since I've no opponent today, wouldn't you like to have a go? Oh, please. I mean, a bit of swordplay. I could teach you. Me? Swordplay? Sure. Why not? Yes. All right, then. I accept your challenge, young sir. But I must warn you, I can swat a mouse with a broom with my eyes closed. Yeah, I knew you had the heart of a warrior. Let's go, then. I'm kind of glad they are letting me do this. Come on, then. Show me what you're made of. Whoever is the first to hit the other ten times is the victor. What if I hurt you, though? Ah, don't worry. I can handle it. Oh, she can't parry, I guess. Haha. <laughs> I get to beat Henry's ass. actually hurt me. How dare you? 
How dare you, Henry? Oh my god! Don't go easy on me, Hal. Ah, very good. <laughs> <laughs> Henry, really? Now that is hardly chivalrous behavior. Now, I shall have to fight for my honor. Take that, you scoundrel! Oh. <laughs> Are you all right? It's nothing. I'm fine. I'm sorry. I didn't mean to. <laughs> Break I'm all of his me. fingers. No, of course not. It's my own stupid fault. It is. I agree. Well, that'll teach you to go around slapping decent, God-fearing girls on the backside. <laughs> Let me have a look at it. No, no, it's only a scratch and a couple of splinters. And I didn't mean to, you know. Show me that. Ah, no, really, it's nothing. So that's how he hurt his hand in the beginning of the game. You know how it is, Hal. You lives by the sword. Dies by the splinter, eh? <laughs> <laughs> you have a girl, Henry. Stop looking at her like that. There now. <laughs> yes, drinking too. By the way, yo Bianca for that beer. Yes, you do. Alrighty, then let's go back to Bianca. She wanted something else from us. I am really glad about that scene, to be completely honest. Uh, I expected much worse from this DLC. And I admit when I'm positively surprised. Uh, hey! Teresa, I'm today. glad to see you! Oh god! God be with you. Do you need anything? What else did you want? I'm what else so was dirty. it you wanted from me? You brought that beer to Henry then? Yes. I did. Uh-huh. And what did he say? We were sword fighting. Nothing much. I don't think she wants to know about the sword fighting. I'm still gonna tell her. He had no one to train with, so we had a bit of sword play together. <laughs> you playing with swords? Yes, and as it happens, I did quite well. Actually, a bit too well. I hit Henry on the hand and wounded him. Really, Tess? I never knew you were such a warrior girl. He had it coming, the donkey. <laughs> Maybe it'll dampen his enthusiasm for adventure. All right. I don't think it but will. now I can tell you what I wanted. Fancy a walk in the woods? Right now? You want to court me in the shade of the pines? <laughs> <laughs> no. I need to big herbs for distilling schnapps. Henry's favorite. Henry again. What herbs do you need? What herbs do you need? I've got almost everything except belladonna. I know a clearing where the best plants grow. Belladonna? But that's deadly poison. It is, if you don't know what you're doing. But don't worry, I haven't poisoned anyone yet. All right, Henry again. Henry's favorite, I see. Yes, I'd like to give it to him tomorrow. I might have known it'd be about Henry again. Well, you know how it is, Tess. Don't worry. You'll find a fellow one day. Yep, That's you're easy one. That's to say when you <laughs> in a tavern where there are fellas swarming around you all day. All I see at the mill are sacks of flour. What about Zbyshek? Mm. Zbyshek? I'd rather settle for a sack of flour. Hmm, I suppose. Your pa would never let Zbyshek have you anyway. Not long ago, when he had a few too many, I heard him say how he was going to get you the richest husband for miles around. Oh, pa. I hope that was just the beer talking. Why don't you go and pick it yourself? 
Papa won't let me go on my own. They say a wolf was seen in the woods recently. A wolf? Hereabouts? So they say. But it was old Blaha who claimed to see it, and he's never sober. <laughs> Still, I wouldn't want to go there alone. Couldn't your brother go with you? Adam? He'd shit himself if he saw a wolf. And besides, someone has to take care of the tavern. But he could lend us his bow. Good thinking, Tess. Uh, thanks? So, you're going to borrow a bow from Adam, and then you want me to go with you to pick Belladonna in the woods? Actually, it's not entirely that simple. Adam won't lend me his bow. The last time he did, I broke the string. You'll have to get it from him. <laughs> anyway, I don't know how to shoot, but Stibor taught you, didn't he? Yeah, but that was a long time ago. It doesn't matter. If the wolf sees a bow, he won't come near us. So will you go and ask Adam? You know he's always liked you. Just give him a wink and the bow is yours. You might be able to do that with Henry, but me? Well, come now. You're as pretty as any lass in the province. And once you've got the bow, meet me on the bridge by the lake, alright? Alrighty. Alright, I'll help you. But next time I want something from you, I don't want to hear any excuses about how you have to see Henry. Deal. You're an angel, Tess. <laughs> nice, that's that's sweet. I also really, really like um, Tess's voice actress. I really like like her. Like a voice. Uh, where are we going? Talk to Adam. Where is Adam? Oops. Oh, there he is. What happened? I was stuck. Hi, Adam. God be with you. Why are you standing on the bench now? Would you lend me your bow? I heard you're a really good archer. And that you've even got your own bow. Uh, yeah. I've got a bow. I made it myself. And I can hit the tree behind the tavern at 20 paces. Good heavens, that's amazing. Um, would you lend me your bow for a while? Lend my bow? To a girl? Well, I don't know, Teresa. Pretty please. I'm not going to do anything wrong with it. Lend it to me and I'll go dancing with you. Will you sell it to me? Uh, I'm not going to do anything bad with it. What's wrong? Are you afraid I'll get up to some mischief with it? I won't break it. Stebor taught me how to shoot and he said I was pretty good. Well, he would, wouldn't he? He's your brother. Shooting a bow takes skill and strength. You'd never even be able to draw it. Would you sell it to me? Well, okay, dancing is the hey, thing. Hey, Adam, if you lend me a bow, I'll dance with you at the next celebration. Oh? You would? Really? All right, here's the bow then. And some arrows. Take it all. Thank you so much, Adam. Wow. God save, Teresa. Uh, meet Bianca near the bridge. Oh. Okay, wait. Hey! Hey! Don't close that door, my face. What I find, what I was about to say, what I find a little weird, but maybe that's um, still coming with Henry and Teresa, is that if she knew Bianca, then why are they never talking about her? That seems like a big elephant in the room. That should be addressed at one point, and as I said, maybe that's still coming. Um, I mean, they seem pretty fresh still in their dating, so maybe that's still a thing. Over you, Tess. I know, right? He does. I've got the bow, we can go. 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 I've got the bow, we can get going. Great, come with me. Right behind ya. Bianca. Can I date her instead? Well, hey, Teresa, wait. There's a magpie's nest somewhere on that tree. Last time I was passing here, I saw that bird carrying something shiny to its nest. Listen, since you've got a bow, 
Why not try and shoot the nest down? Adam does it all the time. So I'm sure there's nothing to it. All right. Okay, is there a nest? Oh yeah, I can see it. Ugh! Hep. Oh, come on. Ah, oh, finally. That only took like 10 tries. Examine nest. Magpie's ring. There was a ring in there. I looked in I the nest. I had a look in the nest. Yeah? And what did you find there? A ring. There was a ring in it. Looks like silver. Really? Holy mother of God. I always wanted a silver ring. But you're the one who shot it down. You can have it. You can have it. You're giving it to me? Tess, you're the best friend ever. Thank you. I'll wear it to the dance this evening. Come on. Let's go and pick those herbs before it gets too late. Sure. Because if it was stolen, then now you are the one getting in trouble and not me. <laughs> God be... Oh, this is the place. I'll start picking, and you keep a lookout. Shouldn't I help with picking? What if I do see the wolf? How long will it take? Yeah, what if what I do What should see I him? do if the wolf turns up, though? You've got a bow, right? Don't think about it. Just shoot him. Besides, you've got Tinker. Although, I'm not sure he's any match for a wolf. Shouldn't I help? Shouldn't I help you pick herbs, too? No, I'll manage fine on my own. I'd rather you kept your eyes peeled for that wolf. All right. All right, I'll keep watch. Just make it quick. Oh, apparently I'm in combat. I'd better pick as much as I can carry. The combat music's playing. But why? I'd oh my god! Mother of God! Ah! It's the wolf! <laughs> Teresa! Do something! Adam! Oh my god! <laughs> oh! 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 Tinker! Tinker! You darling baby! Killed the wolf. Uh, give me all of this. Tinker, you want some some uh, food? Look what I've got for you. You'll love this. Freshly cut from that wolf. Wolf. Here, take it. <laughs> Where's Bianca? Where'd she go? Did she run away? Bianca. Bianca? Bianca! Hey, I'm here! <laughs> about the herbs! I thought those rumors about a wolf were just idle talk. Idle talk, indeed. If I'd been alone, that beast would surely have devoured me. Um, are you alright? Did anything happen to you? No, I'm fine. Thank God. It's a good thing you came along. Um, have you got enough herbs? Did you manage to pick enough herbs? Yeah, I did. Fortunately. I'll brew plenty of that liquor. Enough for you, too. Oh, yes. As a reward. All right. Some hard Thanks. liquor? Nice. I don't think it was a wolf. That was a funny-looking wolf, don't you think? I reckon it was actually a wild dog. Wolf or dog? It was a monstrous beast. Henry will never believe this. <laughs> okay, what now? What will you do now? I'll go back to work at the tavern. There's been quite enough excitement for one day. Thanks for coming with me, Tess. And don't forget to come and see me tomorrow. All right. Will do. Thanks, Bianca. That was a fun adventure. So next we are going to go to... Johanka and see what she wants but we are 
either doing that in the next episode or I'm gonna do that off screen. Whatever you guys want, remember, just tell me if you prefer to see all of it or if you just want me to skip this. It's in your hands now. So thank you so much for watching. If you liked what I do, comment, like, subscribe, all that good stuff. Stay safe, stay healthy. Bye bye and auf Wiedersehen.